good morning guys it is monday back to school after a great weekend i had a great weekend so but now we're gonna go back to school but only for three days so well maybe three days <laughs> that last day is kind of iffy my english teacher is the only one that told the class so yeah and she, she's my last class of the day so i'm not happy about her doing that she's a kind of a kind of a different teacher let me park quick okay now that i'm parked uh <clears throat> i have five minutes to get to class so i'm not gonna be able to talk much just for a second it is a beautiful day first off uh yeah the wednesday thing it's gonna be kind of iffy depends on how many absences i have in my english class i'm gonna ask her today i'm gonna see i'm gonna ask her do you know how many absences i have and she'll probably say no and i'll be like whatever because <laughs> she won't want me to miss that class but she, i think she kind of likes me so i think she'll give me some leverage she told me i was eccentric because i knew british literature I mean, I knew British English, and I wrote British English. That's what she said, I was eccentric. But anyway, train. I'm going to go to class because I'm almost late, so I'll see you guys when we get out. Hey guys, I'm out of class, and I'm actually home. My uh, second, I didn't find this out until I got to class. So I got to class this morning, and she started early, because I got there on time. And she started early, and my uh, peer evaluation student, Lamar, uh was already giving a speech when I got there so I had to stand outside the door and listen through the door so she does that to me sometimes she'll start early and then I'll walk in she's like you're late and I'm like yeah you started early and she's like whatever so anyway um left that class went and got some bojangles for breakfast um and found out my second teacher canceled class because she had to have an emergency root canal which sounds very painful, so I, I don't understand why she let out class today. So I've got about 30, 40 minutes somewhere around there to sit here and do nothing. I came home because I didn't want to sit in my car for an hour and a half and only live five minutes away from campus, so it's not that bad. So I did not want to sit in my car for an hour and a half. So I decided I'm going to come home, try to get some work done. Um, found out I can't get advised until Wednesday. Which really stinks because I need to get advised soon, but not gonna happen. So I guess I'll wait. Uh, hopefully, I won't be too late signing up for classes. I'm gonna go ahead and look and see what's open. That way I can already be planned to sign up for what I want. That would make everything easier and work a whole lot better. Hey guys, I am out of class. I went back to class. Uh, <laughs> For my final class, I did not know anything that she was doing because I barely read the read that story essay we were doing. She did a quiz on it, messed that up, big time. Absolutely hated it. I that, I just didn't feel like reading it, so I read a summary of it. It wasn't good enough. It was a weird story. It's about these guys, kid on this guy on a boat going from England to India and then India back to England, and he ended up the front of the trip to India. He's friends with this guy named Coconut. Yeah, I know, right? If if the story wasn't weird enough, the guy being co named Coconut, on the way back to Europe, he ends up having sexual relationships with this guy named Coconut, and he ends up killing him. Killing Coconut ends up killing. No, he ends up killing Coconut, and then Lionel kills himself by jumping off a boat. So weird story. Uh, just just weird. That's why probably why I didn't want to read it. So anyway, I am going to go chill out. I've already uploaded the vlog, so I'm way ahead today. So I'm going to go chill for a little bit before I have to go to work at 5. So I've got about about 3 hours, roughly. I like my, I like my eyes with that 3 hours. Hey guys, I'm getting ready to go into work. Uh, yeah, it's already 5 o'clock, so I'm getting ready to go to work 5 to 9. There's Carol. Uh, going to work 5 to 9, bagger I believe. So, should be fun, nonetheless. Should be a good night. Um, all I've got to do is clean, and I've got the floor guys, so. Shouldn't be too bad at all, really, to be honest. Shouldn't be bad at all. I don't have that much to do tonight. What's this lady doing? I don't think she knows what she's doing. What up? So anyway, uh, I'm gonna go to work, and I will see you guys when I get off. Hey guys, I am home. 
from work. Uh, sit down, try to do some homework, all this stuff. So, shouldn't be too bad. Shouldn't be too bad at all. Um, don't plan on staying up too late, though. Because I've got class in the morning at 8 o'clock, so. No, not at 8 o'clock at 9.45. Gosh. Maybe I should just go to bed now. <laughs> no, I gotta get the homework done, so. Yeah, I gotta do that. So I know I'm not the only person out there that drinks eggnog. And if they do, do after they drink their eggnog, they go, That's good. That's good. <laughs> or am I just an overly obsessed Christmas vacation fan? That's probably the best option there. Yeah, I absolutely love that movie. I can quote forward, backwards, upside down, left, right, forward, circles. However you want me to quote it, I can quote it. Because it is my favorite movie. And... I, at, when I was at work today, I uh, saw eggnog and I said, you know, find some eggnog. And believe it or not, I've never had eggnog before until tonight. I don't think. Um, anyway, I'm absolutely loving it. I've probably drunk too much as it is already. So, like a half, half a quart or something like that. Yeah, so, it's pretty ridiculous, but it's awesome. I'm gonna get mad over this holidays cost of egg and I'll probably go broke too because it's like three dollars. I decided if I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna splurge and get the best one. I got I got the Southern Comfort one. Oh my gosh. It's like the best thing ever. So anyway. I had chili for dinner when I got off of work. So it's twelve thirty. I'm gonna lay I'm gonna go to bed. Uh get some rest. Um I'm gonna start working on trying to get some more sleep. Because I'm ruining myself not getting enough sleep. <laughs> Frankly, that's what's going on, so I've got to get more sleep. I've got to get my shirt I sleep in out of the dryer. But other than that, I will see you guys in the morning. Good night, guys. Peace out. Tomorrow's my last day of class until next week. Yes. So good night, guys. Peace out. Sometimes I feel like I don't have a partner. Sometimes I feel like I'm my only friend. Is the city I live in, the city of angels. Lonely as I am, together we cry. I feel like every time you guys sing a song, you have to sing it like that. Yeah. Anyway, good night. I just pinpointed that voice perfectly. That's Adam Sandler. <laughs> it has to be. Uh, I'm Adam Sandler. Yeah, you know, it only fits. I can't do his voice, but when he sings, I know he sings a song in some movie that I can't think of right now. And I can picture it in my head, and I can picture him singing it, but I can't tell you what movie it is. I can't, I just can't think of it, but he sings a song somewhere. And he sings it like that, and I can't remember what it's from. It's gonna kill me now. Because I've got the song on the tip of my tongue and it's, it's, it's right there and I can't think of what it is. Oh well. Good night. And I like, I like her. And she showed me her boobies and I like them too. Just so there's no further miscommunication, that was an Adam Sandler movie. That was Waterboy. Good night.